Long time no speak. Welcome back to another J Five O video. It's been a couple while. Um, the reason for an uploading is starting a new job, a new restaurant, and obviously that's being more hours and all that. Uh, so I'm not really had time to upload. Plus, having to work like a week and then has left me a bit skint for the car. But a little update: I have booked the Nuremberg rig, so I booked my ferry from the tenth to the fifteenth of April. So the plan is to go through a few different countries: France, Belgium, Luxembourg, Germany. And then the same rate on the way back. I think that's the plan. Uh, so what I've done to my car is is a decent amount. I'll, um, I'll put some clips in if I can find any. If not, I apologise. I'll be skipping to what I've had done to my car. But if there are some clips, here are the clips and pictures. If there's not, it'll be jumping to me what I've had done to my car. Just seeing all them pictures and videos now, I hope you can see what I've had done and little bits and bobs, so I'm going to explain it. So in the first few images, pictures and videos that you can see, I've had a new throttle body and a new thermostat and a new radiator because they had a coolant leak, but I also didn't have any water going into the engine because the thermostat was seized shut. And I also had a new throttle body because my res was hanging and my throttle was being a bit dodgy. So I had an upgraded LEH, one of them instead of an LEL. Um, as I said, new radiator. I've had the screen in my front console that has now upgraded to more functions like the miles per the gallon, start watch, average consumption, how long you've got left till you need refuel, all that stuff. Not that it works very well, it just puts like a tenner on the car. Um, our digital gauges, what now? So have a PSI and my water temp, but I think my water temp's broke, but I'm gonna get that looked at. Um, I've had my back date brakes, disc and pads done on the back. I'm just trying to think. I wrote a list, but it's on my notes, so I can't obviously come off the recording. And uh, I've had the sides get stuck on properly. Uh, there was no oil leak after all. I've had my boost issue kind of sorted, but I do need a, either a turbo smart 10 PSI or a 14 PSI. That's in discussion to what I need to get. Um, so there, there are some upgrades I will be needing before I go to the, the ring. I've also the DNAs and the show plates on the J5 OSCV private reds put on the back. Um, and there are probably other bits that 
I've not covered, but I just want to explain that that's what I've been up to, been nipping to Vauxhall Conversion in Wales. They've had it all ready for me. I'm due a visit to um, Performance North West. Hopefully get my alloys refurbed. If not, I've got a mate in Hamilton. He'll be sorting me out. But I'm also in talks with a chameleon wrapping company. That's what I think, chameleon wrapping in Birkenhead. Give them a shout out. Not yet done any work with them, but I'm hoping to get in contact with them soon to get my car wrapped a funky colour, which will be getting done after the Nürburgring. We've got the Nürburgring booked in for the 10th to the 15th of April, going through a few different countries. So that'll be good. So just getting the car overall serviced and ready. I've had bonnet raises as well. That's another thing I've had done. So yeah, I'm looking, I'm looking forward to it. Anything else I can think of that I've had done, I will just pop in. But if not... Thank you. I know it's been such a long time since it's uploaded and I'm going to try and do it a bit more, especially leading up to the Nürburgring and that. Uh, but yeah, I hope you like this video and sorry for not subscribing. Don't forget to subscribe, like, click the bell notification button, watch the videos and show me some support and appreciation. Thanks guys.